is learning time from this little book. So what else should we look at? Yeshua said in the dialogue of the Savior, light comes through the mind and illumines the whole body. When all things within you are integrated, your light will shine everywhere. Krishna said that you should shut out the physical world, control the mind, then you will become free. And Buddha said, in order to eliminate the, the discriminating mind, there must be a complete turning around of one's being at the deepest level of consciousness. And Lao Tzu, close the door and shut out the senses. Do this and you will never be exhausted. Of course, some people are gonna ask, how do I do all of this? And one of the ways to do it, and my pref preferred way is through meditation. But not just through meditation, but as each one of these is talking about, by controlling the mind. By shutting out all the negativity that approaches. I rarely watch anything in the news. Most of the time the news is told to me by people who surround me. And even at that, I only allow so much. I only allow enough to cause me to move in a certain way so that there is a solution of peace and harmony within myself and everything around me. Now, in order for you to grow, you have to be able to unify the soul and the mind. The emotions must be under control. You cannot allow yourself to be triggered by anger, by jealousy, by greed, by lust, by any of those negative things that exist in the lower chakras. But you must elevate your consciousness to realize that everything is connected. Every thought, every word, every deed. Those things express what's really going on in your subconscious mind. If you are still expressing yourself negatively, then your subconscious mind is negative. If you're expressing yourself positively, your subconscious mind is positive. Is positive. If you continue to express yourself in such way and shut out the senses, as Lao Tzu says, shut close the door on the negativity, then what you will begin to receive, as Buddha said, is harmony. Harmony within your mind, harmony within your soul, harmony within your outer realm experience. As you do this, you will project yourself into the consciousness of the all. You will become one with the universe. You will truly begin to understand the next level of the fourth dimensional plane of love and then be able to grow higher and higher within the conscious plane of existence, making yourself a peaceful creation with the all and everything around you. Don't be triggered.